my YouTube channel. My name's Alexis Chris, and today we have a couple new things that we're trying out, testing. I don't know if you remember my, I'm sure you do, um, it has like the most views on my channel, the Whiskey and Coke pre-workout one. Um, well, that brand of that pre-workout was Axe and Sledge, and Axe and Sledge ended up reaching out to little me and sending me a bunch of stuff, this being one of them. Ooh! I think I have a tracker on it. I don't, I've noticed that. I don't know how to shut it off. So, and I don't know how I feel about it. Let me know. <laughs> Let me know if we like the, how it follows me around. But anyways, we have this pre-workout we're going to try today. I've already drank almost all of it. But, um, it's, it's like, so I've noticed this with them because the whiskey and Coke one, I, I realize I don't have my microphone on, but I'm not going to wear it. It's fine. You can hear me just fine, right? Um, the whiskey and Coke one was super smooth. And this is no exception. Like, this is super smooth. I'm feeling, um like okay I, I i can only really explain this one way you know how atoms get super excited and they move around i think it's atoms right or just like oh oh um like water how water molecules you know they it, do they move or is that hold on it says i typed in atoms moving fast and it says with an increase in temperature the particles move faster as they gain kinetic energy this is my this is my increased temperature in this in this um in this example i'm giving this is my increased temperature and the particles are just the pieces of matter in my body every every atom in my body and when i drink it they're warming up and they're moving fast and i literally I can feel each particle moving. Does that make sense? I'm itchy. Honestly, I, I don't think this is actually logical. But, um, every atom in my body... Huh, I know her. I'm not embarrassed at all. I'm literally not embarrassed. This is my job. But I like to think of it like, also, got a new phone case. For those of you who have seen my busted phone case, I won't tell you how it got that destroyed. Because, out of embarrassment... But all that matters is that I've, I've got a new phone case and anytime it's like laying down or honestly anytime it's this way I I don't even recognize it. I don't recognize it. It's like getting a nose job, you know It's like I'm having an identity crisis, which by the way, I think it's insane that I still haven't cracked our phone Our phone. It's our phone now. <laughs> it's, it's ours. Um, I haven't cracked my phone and I've had this for actually Honestly, I've had this for almost a year now this specific phone, because last year around this time my phone broke, um, and I had to pay for a new one with cash, the cash in my pocket. I've gotten a few comments recently uh, asking for longer videos with less editing, which will save me a lot of time. But I also just want you guys to know that sometimes I don't make any sense when I talk. So a lot of times the editing is so I make sense, so I'm I, so I can form a cohesive thought. And so you guys won't get confused. But don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I would love to. I, I would love to like do more like longer videos, more raw. But I just thought you guys wouldn't like it. If any, if you give feedback on any video ever, let it be this one. Let me know if you like it. But other than that, we'll keep it pretty raw today. I don't know. The gym looks a little bit busy, but not too bad. So I'm just gonna finish the rest of this which like i said before it's smooth like it's good like i really like it but um we'll go into the gym i'm actually i'm not gonna tell you what i'm hitting so my video retention is longer because if you're curious you'll have to wait and see so yeah also just a reminder that you can follow me on instagram too if you like and i post on there a lot so just so you know okay let's go into the gym I wore the zip up to work a little bit ago. I didn't realize how stained it is. <laughs> but you know, I gotta take it off. It's actually too bad. It's it's bad, so bad that I won't wear it. And that's saying that's saying a lot. <laughs> but you can't see it from afar. Hmm. I can't find like I. Oh, I was gonna say I can't find a resistance band, but I literally just found one. Oh. oh. Okay, I'm too embarrassed of how stained. It's how stained this is, so I'm already taking it off. No pump cover today, I guess. I think I accidentally just ignored someone. I was walking, I was walking past, and um, it looks like maybe he was said something to me, but oh, oh, sorry. 
I didn't even realize it spelled out. Anyways, it looks like maybe he was saying something to me, but um, I didn't know, and my music was playing too loud, so I just kept walking. But I don't know what's more embarrassing, if I were to take off my headphone and he said nothing, or what I did, and maybe he did say something and I just completely ignored him, and he was like around people. I don't know, I feel bad, but I think it would've been more embarrassing if he said nothing to me and I took off my headphone and was like, hmm? so. But today we're heading back. I'm just like kind of warming up my everything. I tend to have like really weird like shoulder problems. I, I said, I talked about it before, but um, yeah, they're still here. Um, I'm also having a really weird back thing going on. So I'm not doing anything like super crazy heavy with no support. So I'm not doing, I normally will do barbell rows, but I'm gonna not today because it's gonna take too much of a toll on my back. My back is really just not doing good, so. We're gonna stay with that. We're gonna do more controlled, more supported stuff. Also, um, why do I always lose one of any pair of anything I have? Growing up, I always lost like one earring. I always lose one strap. So today I'm rocking with a regular strap and like a Versa grip strap. Because I wasn't, I have my other pair, but I hate those so much. So I'm never using those. For some reason, I lose everything except for the ones that I really don't like. <sighs> but anyways, I'm pretty sure if I was a guy, I would lose one of my balls. That's how I literally cannot keep one pair of something. We're gonna start with pull down. I don't know if we're gonna do like a cable pull down or a machine pull down, but um, we'll do one of them. I because I know they have really good like um, they have really good like plate loader machines here. But you know, I love me a good cable lat pull down. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. Okay, so I decided for pull downs, we'll do the cable. But I might just use this grip. Okay. This grip, the one I don't really, I don't need set for. But let's, let's see how. Okay. First set. Um, hold on. <sighs> I do try to uh, blah, blah, try to stay controlled. That was a nice little first set. Everything is really engaged and good. Set, I'll do a drop set. Maybe a double drop set. Ooh. Ready? You ready? I'm ready. And I don't want the world to see me. Cause I don't think that they'd understand. When everything's made to be broken, I just want you to know. I think I'm gonna do some type of row. I'm thinking like a low to high. I think I have that machine. Wow, my shoulders are huge. Okay, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna do both. I'm gonna go a little bit heavier since I did no. Oh, almost fell. That's really bad. Okay. What? Okay, so now I'm gonna try to use my strap and grip. Oh, I don't know about this. Maybe this is too heavy. I did about, I don't remember how many, eight or 10 or something like that. So I'll keep it at this weight and I'll do the same thing like two or three more times. We'll see how the engagement is and we'll see how I feel. But, um, but no, it's nice. I like it. Hopefully my back is cool. I don't think the lighting is very good in this, this spot, but hopefully you guys are enjoying it. I don't know. Okay, ready? Ready? And you can't fight the tears that ain't coming All the moment the truth in your lies When everything feels like the movies Yeah, 
10 like actual reps and then I kind of just like burnt uh, like you know a little bit like half reps and stuff like that so I've one more set so I'm gonna do this really quick but um the lighting is so nice here so we'll just have fun posing at the end of this what should I listen to y'all <laughs> I'm just a little thrown off because I didn't do my barbell rows. Okay, and normally I start with that and then everything just like kind of falls into place. I'm lost, if I'm being honest. I think what next are these. Oh. <laughs> so I guess I'm just gonna do, cause I did, I did pull downs, but like a neutral grip kind of pull down. I did low to high rows. So now I guess I'll do like, that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have to watch this back. If this is too dark, sorry. So I was running on my chest because God knows I have the worst grip strength in the entire world and my forearms burn and tingle and... Yeah, but not in a good way. Okay. Oh, somebody told me that I need to start listening to country music at the gym. No. If you didn't know, which you probably don't, um, I used to really like country. There was a small portion of my life where I really liked country. Those days have, that, that shit has sailed. Those days are gone, really gone. But if you want to know what I do listen to, it is in my link tree. The whole playlist is made. I got a good song, Blaine. Oh, you can't even see me. It feels really weird with like two different straps. We're doing biceps next, by the way. Hey, my song. Okay. Oh my god, I have an itch on my nose. Oh, I forgot to put more weight on. Oh, hold on. I can't. I have to. Oh my god, my nose looks like. Now we're gonna go do biceps. We're gonna do a bicep, a back, a bicep. Call it. Can you hear me? We're gonna do bicep curls now. Let me turn this down though a little bit so it's not super overexposed. Guess what's up? What guess is next? Rear delts. Do I do them here where there's cool lighting? Maybe. You this could be. Ugh. I'm just gonna put it like. Oh! Oh my God, y'all! I like this. Oh! Oh! Hold on. Maybe I'm not standing in the middle. There we go. Nope. I can't really tell what the middle is. Oh, <gasps> y'all, I like this a lot. Oh my gosh. 
Good stuff is happening. Good stuff is happening. Honestly, I've been here for a very long time, so I'm not going to do another bicep just because, you know, back engages your biceps anyways. And, you know, I don't think I need them. <laughs> you know, I got some big bicep. But um, so this is going to be my last set of anything today. A little rear delf. I always kind of end up finishing off with rear delf. Oh. I have this problem where I, I always forget to turn on my microphone. Then it did just a second ago. Okay. And I don't want the world to see me Cause I don't think that they'd understand When everything's made to be broken I just want you to know who I am And I don't want the world to see me Cause I don't Imagine if my imagine if my arms just ripped off. Okay. Okay, thank you guys. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I hope you watched all the way through. I hope you enjoyed it. Overall, pump was great. Um, the lift was great. But um, hope you enjoyed. I love you all so much. You can also find me on Instagram. You guys know this. It's in my it's in my description and also um, my my playlist if you wanna listen to what I listen to if you want. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much. And until next time. XOXO.